This is an artifact that I think is of particular importance. This is a Nansen passport. Before World War I, people really didn't need many documents to immigrate. It was, uh, nobody really asked for them. But because of World War I, there's a huge flood of refugees, millions of people in Europe, in the Middle East, uh, perhaps in the Russian, uh, the Russian Revolution. The, all these refugees were trying to move elsewhere. And nation states <clears throat> began tightening up the regulations on them. To get in the country, you had to have papers from your previous country to allow you to show who you were, uh, identify you, etc. And if you didn't have those pro those papers, you would have real problems. You were stateless. Many of the Armenian survivors of the genocide were stateless. Turkey was not going to issue them documents that they were former Turkish citizens. So what do they do? And and Friedhof Nansen was the uh, commissioner of human. Uh, Commission of Human Refugees for the League of Nations. And he came up with the idea of a Nansen passport. This is an artificial passport, kind of a legal fiction, which would be used for stateless people so that they could have a document that identified them when they went to a different country. Uh, this particular one was donated to the museum by Olga Prudian, who was the daughter of General Dro. The And as you see, this, the actual passport is of Ruben Durharatunian, who was a very famous uh, set designer for, for operas, etc. This is a Wikipedia article about his life. Uh, he, he won the Tony Award in, 19, in uh, 1959 for one of his set designs. Anyway, so this is his, uh, his passport to get to America. He was born in Tiflis. And some of the, this is the gentleman right here. And the various countries he went through in order to get to as a stateless person to get to the United States. He arrived in the United States in 1948, and, uh, what do you call it? and he died here. He died in 1992. All his drawings and his documents are part of the Lincoln Center Collection of Performing Arts in New York City. Uh, but we do have his Nansen passport with us, thanks to Oprah